working on this show was truly a collaborative effort. And I think that being at a private gallery, this is the first time I've been experiencing how much it takes to bring shows together and bring artists together. My name is Deja Bellardo. I'm currently a gallery assistant at Pace Gallery. I started here in November, so almost eight months now. Wow, is that right? That feels like a long time. It's been, it's blown by. I've been having fun. The theme of the staff show is called Atmospheres. And what I think was the most interesting for me, we all work at Pace and we all work with Pace artists. We all uh, are influenced by what it means to be surrounded by blue chip artists, blue chip art. And the way that we all responded to that word atmospheres took natural groupings that I was very surprised by and yet so diverse because they were so distinct in everyone's own personal experience that it was really refreshing to see what came together in the staff show. We had 76 uh, total artists submit and 100 works. So there were multiple works by some individuals, especially in the case where the works were smaller, photographs that really naturally grouped together and really helped the show to be realized in the way it was and flow together. And then, you know, we had larger paintings that really drew you in and sculptures and lots of different variations, installations, um, even NFTs, uh, just a really wide range and really trying to capture the diversity of the art that we're all creating. Oliver came in with the exhibition team and, you know, Sarah and the exhibition team created a mock-up, did some initial placings of the works. You can see by the way everything was laid out, you kind of come in and you get the bright colors and you have the people who are there, you know, responding directly to nature itself lots of landscape photography landscape paintings even in the abstractions all created to the natural world and then you move on towards the show and you have people who are uh, working with their experience of themselves and how they navigate the atmospheres we exist in and so you get um, people who are responding on their own personal histories um, expressions of themselves in the, in the atmospheres in the natural worlds and how they navigate it what was emotionally moving for me uh, throughout the staff show was outside of looking at their works visually, I really got to know people in a way that I didn't have access to before. And a lot of people were very vulnerable and you don't see that in their everyday work life. You know, you come in and you do your jobs together, but to really have that intimate moment with people, I think it does a lot for reminding us all why we exist in the art world and why it is that we work for other artists and what continues to fuel us as artists ourselves. And I think that other people are gonna be able to easily recognize that because Pace, we, we do a lot of great work in the art world. And I think people understand that and to see something from the people who helped to create that uh, really allows them to more meaningfully connect to the gallery itself. At the end of the day, we have so many people here who are actually interested and invested in the art, invested in what it means for artists to be people first and actually considering why their art is important to the artists themselves and what it means for the artists to share their work with the general population because art is moving. And I think that because we have those core values from the beginning of this institution, People are drawn to that, the workers are drawn to that, that idea that we care about the artists. That feels like we're headed in such a brilliant direction as a gallery and as a team. And as a group of artists who are working together, it's really, really delightful and really hopeful. The, the room was filled with so much beautiful energy and everyone just genuinely seemed happy. You know, it just really feels like a family, a community uh, has been built. It was really, it was really great. I'm still riding a high on it. <laughs>